Premier League debut, first game against Spurs on match of the day, man of the match. Tell us about your day. Oh, it's been unbelievable. You know, got to obviously got told yesterday morning what I got for that I've been put in. Um, you know, since then I've just been buzzing and raring to go. Um, it doesn't get much better than being on Sky Sports and against Tottenham, a great side. Um, so I was happy that I could keep a clean sheet and we got three points in the end. And some of those saves in the first half, they weren't easy. They were they were pretty impressive. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, it was buzzing that I could make, help the team out to get the win as well. So, um, yeah, you know, once you make the first one, you get into a rhythm and you get grow uh, in confidence as you get make the more saves. But um, I was just buzzing that it went well. Is there one in particular that stands out that you're looking forward to seeing back? Yeah, I think the first one because, you know, it's your first save in the Premier League, gets you into the game and stuff. Um, and just the confidence grew from there, I guess. And this, well, you found out yesterday morning. How's the last 24 hours been for you in terms of a frame of mind, in terms of being ready and not being nervous, not yeah. being overawed by it all? Yeah, definitely. You just got to relax and see it as a game of football at the end of the day. Um, you know, I didn't see it as too much pressure to go out and express myself. Um, you know, the gaffer just said, go and enjoy yourself. And, you know, that made it easier for me. And last night, I just chilled out with the parents, trying to take my mind off it. And then, thankfully, you know, today went well. And I saw in the first few minutes, um, the ball seemed to come to you and you seemed to want to demand it back to your feet. Was that to sort of calm yourself down or was it just the sort of confidence you have as a player? No, it's the way I've, I've always played in with the 21s and stuff, so I guess it's just in the way I play, you know. Um, I like to play out from the back um, and I'm not afraid to get in the ball. And You know, there's a few bits that I can improve on today, but um, no, it went OK in the end. <laughs> OK indeed. <laughs> and of course you train with Premier League players yeah. all day, every day. Was there anything that you learnt today, anything that sort of surprised you at all about playing coming up against Tottenham? Yeah, obviously the, the standard so high with teams like that, but I've just learned a lot about myself and seeing I could uh, deal with it under high, uh, high pressure situations. I think that was the main thing that I got from today. And the game itself, of course, the first half was all about you and the second half, I suppose, wasn't really much to do with you because it was all about us trying to make sure we got that win. Yeah, 100%. You know, as I said earlier, um, it was a game of two halves, wasn't it? So it was great to get... You know, obviously the first half was loads of shots, nice and busy, but then the second half was, you know, just keep your concentration and make sure you're on it. Um, but, you know, a team, with, a team uh, of Tottenham's calibre, even with nine men, they're still dangerous. So, but um, to get the clean sheet was great. And then, of course, the 90 minutes ticks past, we've won the game, but that only just sort of started the adventure for you. You've, you've spoken to Sky, you've spoken to matches of the day, you've been upstairs to get the yeah. man of the match award. What's the last 10, 15 minutes been like for you? It's been a bit crazy, yeah, it just hasn't sunk in yet. I'm um, still waiting to see the family and stuff, so that'll be a great moment as well. But um, no, nah, I'm just, just letting it enjoy it all, and um, it's a great day. And it seems as though you've hopefully got a really bright future with us. Uh, that's the plan, hopefully, you know, I can keep pushing on now. Uh, still a game next week as well, that'll try and push into the team as well, and hopefully have a good pre-season as well next year. Has the manager mentioned anything either about your performance today or maybe your prospects for next week? Uh, not yet. Uh, there's been so many interviews <laughs> so far. I haven't really had a chance to speak uh, in detail to anyone, but you know, all the lads were buzzing for me, which was great as well. Congratulations, Congratulations Mark. Cheers. Thank you.